हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू एच जे प्रोग्रामिंग सोल्यूशन सो इन लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव सीन वट इज द लैमडा एक्सप्रेशन एंड वट इज द फंक्शनल इंटरफेस इन टूडेज वीडियो लेट्स डिस्कस अबाउट द डिफॉल्ट मेथड हाउ वी कैन क्रिएट द डिफॉल्ट मेथड इन द इंटरफेस एंड वाई दिस डिफॉल्ट मेथड इज इंट्रोड्यूस्ड इन जावा एट ओके इन मेनी इंटरव्यूज यू विल गेट द क्वेश्चन वट इज द डिफॉल्ट मेथड एंड वाई इट इज इंट्रोड्यूस्ड इन द जावा एट ओके सो लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड दैट सो वेरी फर्स्ट लेट्स क्रिएट वन मोर पैकेज हियर एंड लेट मी गिव द नेम ऑफ द पैकेज एज डिफॉल्ट मेथड एग्जाम्पल ओके and inside this package let's create one interface with the name vehicle okay now in this vehicle interface let's write the method void mm, show okay so this is one abstract method which have which we have in the vehicle interface okay and uh, let's write one more method void uh, types of type of uh, vehicle okay so these are two methods we have in this interface okay now let's create the uh, class which will implement this interface okay so let's create the class and we will give the name of the class as a car and this car class implementing the vehicle interface okay vehicle okay now whenever we are implementing the interface we have to provide the implementation for all the abstract methods present in that interface okay so let's write the implementation here and we will write here the show method of car okay and here we will write uh, type of vehicle so we will write here four wheeler okay so this way we can write now if we go to the vehicle okay so here let let's create one more class and we will give the name of the class as uh, auto okay and this auto is also implementing the vehicle interface so here also we have to provide the implementation for both the methods okay so here we will write is out and uh, show method of auto and in the type of vehicle we will write three wheeler okay so now see here we have created two classes one is auto and one is car and one interface we have which is vehicle okay this Vehic, uh, this uh, uh, class which is car implementing this vehicle interface and auto is also implementing the vehicle interface okay but now if we go to the vehicle and here i want to add one more method okay uh, let's suppose i want to add the method void and uh, display information of car okay so this type of method i want to write here in the vehicle interface so if we are writing like this then see here we are getting two problems if i go to the car see here i have to implement the, that method okay which we have written in the vehicle interface this display information of car method we have to implement in the car class also we have to implement that in the auto class right so this is the issue like if we already developed the interface and now if we want to provide 
any method inside this interface then the other classes which are already implementing this interface are getting impacted right so now if you try to add here the new abstract method then this car and auto class is impacting right they are giving the error now so that is the reason they have introduced the default method means for the backward compatibility okay so how we can write the default method just you have to add here a default keyword and here you can provide the implementation directly okay now if you see in the car class we don't see any issue even in the auto we don't see any issue okay so by using this default method they have given the backward compatibility means even if you want to add anything in this vehicle interface then your other classes which are implementing this interface will not get impacted okay so that is the reason they have introduced the default method okay so now here you can write anything the default implementation you can just write here so default implementation okay and even if this uh, car and auto okay these classes want to uh, use this uh, default method they can provide the implementation here they can override that default method also here okay so how we can override that you just have to go there click on the generate and here you can implement the method this one display information of the car okay so now here it is calling the uh, method from the vehicle interface okay but you can provide your own implementation as well so here we can write a out and uh, car class default method okay now let's create one more class here and we will give the name as a main and inside this main class let's write the main method okay and now let's create vehicle vehicle is equal to new car okay and now if you uh, call the method vehicle dot type of vehicle okay then let's see what we will get right click and run see here we are getting four wheeler okay because this is uh, from this vehicle interface we have this type of vehicle okay and this type of vehicle uh, method is impl uh, implemented in this car class okay so see here in car we have provided the implementation and here we have four wheeler so that's the reason we are getting output as a four wheeler okay now if we call this default method in this default method we have written car class default method we have overridden the default method here okay so if we go here and call the this the method name display information of car okay so now see here what will be the output we are getting car class default method okay and uh, i think if we remove the implementation form here okay and still if we are calling that method then we will get the default implementation whatever you have written in your interface so in interface we have written default implementation okay so that way we can create the default methods in the interface and we can provide the default implementation and after that in the implemented classes even if you want to override the method you want to change the implementation you can and if you don't want then uh, then also you will not get any issues okay
Now this way we understood that how we can create the default method in the interface and why these default methods are introduced in Java 8. Okay, so very main reason to introduce these default methods are to provide the backward compatibility and other reason is that let's suppose in the interface we have thousands of methods okay and if all those methods are abstract then we have to provide implementation of each and every method in the implementation classes okay but let's suppose in this vehicle interface we have some methods okay uh, void m1 and void m2 okay so these are two methods i have written in the vehicle interface okay now this m1 and m2 we have to implement in the auto interface also in the car interface okay okay but let's suppose this m1 and m2 are the methods which are not required in the car class still this car class need to provide the implementation because of the interface okay because in the interface we if we have the abstract method anyhow we have to provide the implementation of that methods but because of this default methods we don't have to provide implementation for this method in the uh, implemented classes we can just provide here the default uh, implementation and then if any class required that uh, class that method to be used then they can just use that method or they can override the method with their own implementation okay so that is the one more reason default method is introduced in the java 8 i hope you understood that what is the default method and why it is introduced in the java 8 okay so that's it for today's video if you like the video, please share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you.